Chris Sims, his seventh year out of Texas, the unrestricted free agent, third round pick by Tampa, appeared to break through in 2005, playing 10 games for the Bucs, 2,000 yards passing, 10 touchdowns this year. He got off to the rough start in two thicks in 2006, and then Sims ruptured his spleen. Quick completion with the tight end inside the 40 yard line. Sims has time and he throws and it's complete inside the five yard line. It'll be second down, ball at the six yard line. Second and goal for the Broncos trying to get on the board. Time for Sims and he throws and it's a touchdown for the Denver Broncos. Jeff Poots here for the Broncos and gets him on the board and Denver breaks through and I can hear it now. Sim should be the quarterback. Boutier has been around eight years. He's out of Boise State, a former sixth-round pick by the Broncos in 2002. Well, Sims put together a great drive right here. He, he took over the offense here in the second half, and he just marched them down the field methodically and, and got his team into the end zone. And up until that point, they weren't able to do anything, and he just made it look you know, relatively easy on that drive. Sims throws, and boy, a dangerous pass, but he completes it. First half interceptions, and now the Broncos threatening to take the lead. Sims a lot of time, throws downfield, and he's got a man. And it's Brandon Lloyd out at the 10-yard line. So the ex-49er with his third reception all coming here in the second half. But quarterback and receiver developing a little relationship. Brendan Lloyd knows how to create space and he did that when he was here and right here you see him just you know right he ran a nice you know corner route he was able to just get in between the cover two coverage find the hole there's a gap there where if the quarterback can deliver the ball is second down and eight for the Broncos Sims remains at quarterback and the quick out pattern is complete he breaks a tackle and gets up to the 40 yard line Broncos have actually used two timeouts and they have only one remaining Snapped on the ground. Sims picks it up. Buys time. Goes downfield. He's got a man. It's McKinley. Touchdown, Buckles. Just talked about it. You don't put any pressure on the quarterback. You give him a, an opportunity to run around, get outside of the pocket. Things break down down the field. There's a clock, a time clock in the defense's back's head, and you start to look around. You know, and young guys, you, they will lose their discipline, and things like this happen. So, Jahi Ward Daniels was the man in coverage, and McKinley just kept going. And I think you have to credit Chris Sims, who. It had to keep in perspective that he did not play against the 49ers first team defense But I think that Sims has done everything the Broncos have asked of him and Regardless of what defense he played against There's going to be some controversy tomorrow. Now the Broncos are going for the The Broncos are going for the game winning score. They're going for two points trailing by one And it's Incomplete. It's picked off by uh, Smith in the end zone, and the 49ers turn him away. And uh, I'll give Josh Josh McDaniels credit on that. He didn't want a tie game in the preseason. That's a two-minute warning. 